The eighth edition of the Abu Dhabi Film Festival kicked off with a local twist. For the first time, the festival opened with a local feature film, Ali Mustafa's From A to B, occupying a slot usually reserved for big-budget Hollywood films. From A to B marks the first time an Emirati feature has opened the festival in its near decade of operation. Arab stars and other international stars in the cinema world graced the red carpet on opening night. Led by the man of the hour himself, Mustafa, who was joined by Fadi Rifai, Shadi Alphonse, and Fahad al Butairi, who played the film's lead roles as pals on a road trip from Abu Dhabi to Beirut to honor their best friend who has died. I was very happy it was chosen uh, to be the opening film here. Um, I actually haven't seen the movie yet, so I'm super excited. Uh, I'm a bit nervous as well. Um, this Where is my first feature film, so I'm very, very excited. Industry heavyweights included Cheryl Boone Isaacs, the two-term president of Academy of Motion, Picture Arts and Science. Although she said she hasn't seen much from the Arab film industry, she told Tabloid she believes the representation of Arabs in Hollywood is improving. I think everyone around the world is opening up. Mm -hmm. You know, the world's getting smaller. Mm -hmm. We can travel around a lot more. We're able to experience other people's storytelling and dreams. And I think it's it's all going to be good. It's all going to get more. Last year, Indian actor Irfan Khan was here for the premiere of his hit film, The Lunchbox. This year, he is president of the festival's Narrative Features Competition Jury. Movie has to give you experience. You know, you cannot look for a particular thing in a movie. It has to give you experience, has to engulf you in its own world. And you should be engrossed in that world. And that world should be able to reveal things to you, you know, to tell you, to give you emotional experience or, you know, intellectual experience. So all this thing, you know, it's just a new world which you which you get out of a film, yeah. an experience. While French-Algerian director Rashid Bukharib and American producer Edward Pressman were recipients of ADFF's Career Achievement Awards, which was awarded during the opening ceremony. Pressman is known for his films such as The Crow, American Psycho, and Wall Street. Bukharib's most recent film, Two Men in Town, stars Forrest Whitaker as a Muslim convert. When I, I decide to make a movie in America, uh, I like uh, so much the actor Forrest Whitaker and uh, when I wrote the script I would like to have something uh, can connect to me. My character is converted to Islam. It's interesting for me for to why I made this movie in America. We're looking forward tonight to seeing this uh, Emirati film A to B. And uh, do you think in the future you would collaborate and work with uh, Arab filmmakers? Uh, I, mean, I hope so. We've worked all around the world in many, many areas. And uh, I would think there's some great talent here. And as the film community here grows, that's, what's, that's why it's good. We also had a chance to talk with the granddaughter of Charlotte Chaplin, Carmen, who revealed the legendary actor was a visitor in the Middle East. I think he, he visited the Middle East. Um, so I think he'd be very curious to come back and see what's changed and he'd be delighted to be here with a film festival because he loved movies so I think he'd be very excited to see, see some movies here. The Abu Dhabi Film Festival runs until November 1, screening a total of 197 films including 9 feature-length world premieres and 48 short film premieres. Irish Eden Belyaza for Tabloid. Yeah.